Hello, welcome back to Fallout 4. Um, I'm just gonna go speak to um, uh, Mr. Krabbit, Jack Krabbit, I think his name is. Um, I can't remember which are the other ones that I killed. I killed this one. Um, there was another one, but I don't know which one it was. Um, let's go in. Right, here we... Looks like someone had a bad day. Yeah, it does. You're right. Um, we just need to go down this um, elevator that's back here, I believe. So, uh... Jack Crabbit was uh, having a look at his uh, dad's... Um, Experiments or his power or whatever, and um, figure out how he uh, had the telekinesis and stuff like that. And we were to report back to his findings. This is what we're doing now. Hello, hello, Jack Crabbit. Hi. Hi, you're back. Good news. I figured out how to access the artifact's telekinesis effect. I hooked it up to this old laser rifle. There's no way to control it without direct neural input, or better or worse. All of that was destroyed when my father died. But you still have a rather powerful directed force. Here, say what you think. Sweet. How does it work? It uses standard energy cells for power. The artifact's internal power supply was destroyed. Otherwise, point and shoot. It doesn't kill people. But you may still be able to find some use for it. <coughs> As for myself, I don't know. Maybe I'll finally travel to the southwest. My father was always convinced that there was another alien city buried somewhere in the Mojave Desert. Have at it. I never liked messing with this technical crap. Yeah, cool. Yes, yeah, so we got this uh, neat little gun. I just wanted to do that, get that out of the way. Um, and now I think we can uh, head back. This was the elevator we took, wasn't it? Come on. Ah, uh, too late. Better get the stairs or appear right behind me. Hello. Hey. Sure, sure. Just keep your shirt on. Cool. Um, yes. Once we get to top, we'll figure out where to go. Once we're outside, uh, this way. Right, so I did a few things while we were away, um, between episodes. Uh, one of them being uh, I jumped into the institute and picked up a bunch of missions by them, but I think they're repeating. Uh, missions. I um, also listened to a radio broadcast that gave me that mission. So if we uh, skip Spoils of War, uh, skip that one. These might be quite quick, so what's the closest one? Remove worker. Um, yes. I guess that's the closest one. And uh, we'll do there. Jeez, it's pretty, uh, Crazy around here.
Why is there so many of these guys? Jesus, like. Here what? You're pretty nifty. Yeah, so I changed my companion to Kate. Um, she's pretty neat. <sighs> I don't really think I need to check out. I mean, ammo. Yes, ammo is good. Ew. Well, they've got loads of book return tokens. Um, I might actually take some of them. What are they there? Stairs, is it? Where's this location I'm looking for? you come from? So we're down here, I guess. Not sure if I've been in here. You're gonna drag that junk around. Yes, I am, and do not question. Find something a wee bit easier to shoot these guys. It's got so much ammo as well. Ah, solar. No lightnesses, so. Please. Your likenesses. Uh, swap silks. Uh, sands. They all have a likeness. A large. Nice. Here we go. I can take out some. Can uh, take out some uh, cockroaches. Roaches, Thanks. Chips don't really need to worry about food. Ooh, day tripper. There's a lot of them around here, eh? Let me know if you want. She get it locked, said it not, no? Me to help That's you. it. Put that lock, or any lock for that matter. Getting into places I'm not wanted is a talent I've acquired over the years. You like it when I pick locks? Well, make sure to pick loads of locks. Excuse me, sorry. Some chems. You like chems, don't you? Buff 
Sulfite and the Urino. Right. Jeez. Got it. So there's some traps here and there. Too interested in there. What you got there? Bobby pins, because you were trying to get in there. You were what? Leveled up. Nimble hunting rifle. Nice. Haven't had anything. Not had any nimble things before. I always pick up cigarettes because I know they're worth money, but I never sell them. Never remember to sell them. Probably get used for cloth sometimes. Oh. Right, let's uh, get this one open. Um, want. Oh, so I want in. Okay. Uh, nope. Nope. Maybe. No. Nope. Body. Uh, going in here would be a good idea. Advanced. <sighs> Offline. Let's turn it off. Got it. There we go. Be us. This is very atmospheric.
Oh, that cage didn't help you much there, did it? No, not really. <gasps> oh, hiccups. Drink my juice too quick. Um, what was it? I came down here after again? I have no idea. Come down here, kill some raiders. It's the mission, right? The Institute sent me. Take this transmitter and they'll send a courser to pick you up. I look forward to returning to my duties. That was it, really? Cool, okay. Wow. I don't care that much that they had a fucking captured a robot. It's not like it's a person. I don't know why they would care about getting one back. What the fuck was that? Your worst nightmare. You again. I see meeting you around here. fun. It is pretty fun beating these guys up. Cooler. these dead bodies yeah idiot yes 
there's not much else in here. Trains are damn cool looking, I have to say. Cement. I like cement. Well, that was exciting. Let's off go off to the next one. Um, right. Let's get a walking. Hey. Hmm? No. Nah. She would have some chat for me. I just need to lock a unlock a lot of set. Listen to the emergency signal. See what I see. This message will repeat. Well, this seems like I have found a cool place. Expert. Plundered. This is an emergency message to all Commonwealth Army soldiers. Emergency protocol 17 Echo Charlie 9 are in effect. Where is she? Where is she gone? Oh, there you are, just standing behind the tree. What is it? Um, getting this armor for me. Go on, you can do it. Emergency protocol 
super mutants. Sweet, I want to check out the rest of this place while I'm here. This checkpoint has been designated as a safe house in case of enemy invasion, and is currently stocked with additional food, water, and ammunition. Ooh, there's a magazine here. Nice. Hell yeah. This is an emergency message to all Commonwealth Army soldiers. Emergency protocol 17 Echo Charlie Niner are in effect. Can I turn this off? If you are in distress, please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint Parade. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. This checkpoint has been designated as a safe house in case of enemy invasion, and is currently stocked with additional food, water, and ammunition. This safe house is for military personnel only. Citizens, including non-military family members, will be turned away from matters of national safety. We could hold out pretty well. This message will repeat. You're not wrong, we could hold out here for a reasonably long time. Um, I need to... Uh... This is an emergency message to all Commonwealth Army soldiers. Emergency protocol 17 Echo Charlie Niner are in effect. If you are in distress, please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint Parade. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. This checkpoint has been designated as a safe house in case of enemy invasion, and is currently stocked with additional food, water, and ammunition. This safe house is for military personnel only. Citizens, including non-military family members, will be turned away from matters of national safety. God damn it, I hate these master ones. There we go. Yes. This is an emergency message to all Commonwealth Army soldiers. Emergency protocol 17 Echo Charlie Niner are in effect. Please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint Parade. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. Is there anywhere I, I can turn this goddamn thing off? Maybe here. Same stuff I looked at before. Yeah, you're right. Where? Where is it? If you are in distress, please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint Parade. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. <clears throat> All right. Um, I couldn't find where to. Uh, whoops. I meant to reload there. I couldn't find where to uh, turn it off, so I'm just leaving because uh, I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. And I totally headed the wrong way for heading there. This is the right location. <laughs> yeah. 
I headed in completely the wrong direction and ended up there. Where is Kate? Oh, there she is. Super Mutant Radio bro Broadcast. Alright, don't know if you can hear that radio broadcast very well, but there's a, a, a woman pretending to be a super mutant. Hopefully we'll pick it up a bit clearer once we get closer to where we're going. That happens to be where we're going. But I want to eat human. Yes, I know you do. Look, I'm reading this exactly like you want it. Remember? It's a trick. You're trying to trick them with a lie. Oh, yeah. You're right. Right. Where was we? We not hurt you. We just want to help you. Jesus Christ. Lost devils too, Jesus.
Jesus. Right, let's turn that off now. Jeez. Well, that was, um... That was annoying. Why did you have to go get yourself into trouble, lady? Did I help somehow? Whatever. I think we can enter this high school now. Shotgun's gonna. Ah, uh, and I'm walking slow. Shit. Right, let's try not to pick up too much stuff. Strong super mutants right here.
Have a minute. Got something on my mind. Yeah, sure, go on. Of course. Anything you need. Anything I need, huh? I might take you up on that one day. After Tommy stuck me with you, I was expecting to hate your guts. Not only because you agreed to pick up me contract, but because I was waiting for you to order me around like hired help. Now, so far, you've been treating me like a friend. Hell, you've been damn near nice to me. Now, I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but your kindness is starting to make me wonder if there's anything I learned in the combat zone. It was that nobody does things for other people without expecting something in return. What exactly do you think I'm expecting in return? Who knows? Doing your laundry, taking a bullet for you, hauling your gear. What's the difference? I don't think I'm getting through to you. Let me explain what I mean, then maybe you'll understand where I'm coming from. I spent three years living at the combat zone. Smelled like puke and piss. But I called it home. I was making a few caps. Had me own bed to sleep in and three hot meals a day. Then the raiders took over the place. You know that lot. You aren't exactly what you'd call the gentle type. After they moved in, if you didn't keep looking over your shoulder, you were liable to get sucker punched or robbed. Or worse. It didn't take me long to learn that I had to put my hard-earned caps to good use. Buying friends was essential to making life easy. So, I guess I'm waiting for you to hand me a bill. You know what I mean? You don't owe me a thing. Now I'm having a real hard time believing that. I'll tell you what, give me some time and I'll think of something I can do to repay you. I'm not a rich girl, but I'm sure we can agree on something. After all, what are friends for? Awesome, cool, whatever. What's in your lunchbox? A pencil. I'll take the lunchbox on. It's a great time to just stop and have a chat, you know. It's the memos again. Right there. Let me just double check the map. There is. There is definitely something here. There's another lunchbox. A spoon. Who's there? 
Ah, that's where that guy was. Oh, we'll get down there. of alcohol in the school. Right, we went all the way around there. Went down there. Went down here. That's just back along here. Oops. Kitchen, some random food and cutlery. Um, nothing in the lockers. Rat poison. Mom, what the hell happened here? It's, it's things. Science lab. Mammals. This has got a bit more to it. Swiss. One. Heels. Three. Years. Really? It's just the same old shit. Some folder, some burnt book, some random hand. They dissected hands in this science class. Oh, maybe that was a home ec class. Yeah, that's why they had kitchen utensils. Sea captain's hat. Student terminal. Oops. Don't think there's any use to going into that room downstairs. I think I've uh, actually been in there. So uh, that just leaves this door.
Broke my other leg, god damn it. Uh, that's one where I needed the super mutant tissue. Leave that junk behind. You're just wasting space. If you think this is bad, you should see some of the blokes I beat up at the combat zone. Yes. Mentas. How much weight do I need to drop? Jesus. Look alive. Point out what you need. And Got me good. Right, Burton. I'm here. Hurry up. Out with it. I have a lot of plans for this summer, and none of them involve chatting with you. Why, Ronald? I'm hurt. Skipping the pleasantries and getting right down to business. And after all we've accomplished together this semester. For the last time, you little snot, it's Principal Tanner. Fine, Principal Tanner. I'll make this quick. You've been giving me mentash to distribute to the students quietly and under the nose of the faculty. I have. Because of this, test scores have skyrocketed. The school board has noticed. We received quite an increase in funding. But the faculty doesn't know. No one here knows except you. And now, me. You've been skimming off the top and pocketing most of the funds. I want 50% of what you're embezzling. We'll go to Superintendent Marcella with this. What? How did you... Giving me brain pills every week. What did you expect, you pathetic little man? Well, so what if it's all true? No one's going to believe you. You're just a kid, and I'm the principal, and more importantly, an adult. Oh, I think they'll believe me, Ronald. Especially after they hear you admit everything in your own words. What are you talking about? Wait, is that a hollow tape? You son of a. Oh, so we've been giving mintets to the kids. That's uh, that's bad news bears right there. Um, so uh, it's nearly time for the end of the episode. I just um, they have they are broadcasting. Um, I like to turn the broadcast off. Yeah, look, mintets. Mintats. Oh, 
expert one. Oh, god damn. Friggin' memos again, god damn it. I'm so sick of memos. Alright, I think I found everything there is to find here. Um, I'm just gonna finish the episode now, so uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, press the like button. If you've got anything to say, leave it in the comments. Otherwise, I will catch you in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.